that's our view. Oh. Nice. And our friend, Captain Mike, the motor goaters, they're uh, right over here. Yeah, we're pretty close to the restroom, which is nice, but we're not right on top of it. But there's Miss Tarina, Miss Katrina, and Teresa, her twin. Hi. And I got to go. Michael's telling me a story that the Rangers told him. I got to go hear about this. So, what were you saying about the bells that we bought to carry around? When we're hiking, the bear bells? Well, <clears throat> apparently they have uh, done research and they found that the bear bells actually attract the bears because it, it makes them curious. So we just growl at them, shoot our bear spray and run like hell. We talk, have loud conversation, just normal conversation, but have your bear spray. Well, all right then. So y'all let us know in the comments what you think about the bear spray and the, uh, not the bear spray, but the uh, bells. Oh yeah. Did I already tell you that's our view when we get up in the morning? Ah, it's going to be so great. It's going to be great. Y'all stay tuned. So there's my solar portable panels. They come with the EcoFlow. First time I used them, I didn't really know how to use the case that it comes in. But if you look there on the top, you can see it sticking up the top. That's part of the case. Bungee City. And then that's the bottom of the case. And it just comes with its own little hook and everything. It hooks up like that and it puts it at a good angle. So the sun's coming out good right now. But uh, <clears throat> yeah, the EcoFlow is not showing any charge at the moment because it's already got 100% charge from uh, the truck charging it on the way up here. So we'll see what happens after our excursions tomorrow. What you doing, babe? Getting out my creamer. Oh, we're gonna try one of freeze dried meals tonight, aren't we? Yes, we are. Let's see what we're, gonna, what we're gonna have. So we're heating up water. Yep. And we're gonna try this Peak Refuel Chicken Teriyaki Rice. For Meal for King. Yep, it's for two folks, two servings. We shall see how it works. Time for coffee. This is a view from our campsite. Pretty cool, huh? Talk about cool, it's supposed to be 32 degrees in the morning. <laughs> that ought to be real interesting. Yeah, we got our first bear sighting, if you can see him. Oh, he's coming at us. Look at that, he's coming to see us. Check him out. We finally made it up here to Maline Lake. We're going to take a boat tour out across the lake to a little island area, I think. But uh, yeah, oh man, it's just beautiful around here.
We'll catch you back on the boat. We're on the boat, getting ready to go out for the lake cruise. It's a pretty cool little thing. Spirit Island today, so it's about 35 minutes there. And then we actually have the opportunity to hop off the boat for 15 minutes once you arrive there. So you can get off, walk around a little bit, and stretch our legs, as well as see some photos uh, before climbing back on board the Curly Phillips here. Well, we just got off the boat here. We got 15 minutes to spend here before we head back. But, uh, yeah, this is what's around us. We'll get some pictures to go along with this. here for a little short hike and uh, on the hunt for one of them red chairs that's so prevalent out here and uh, I don't know if you can see it or not look along these trees it's starting to snow on us it uh, yeah I don't know if the video is going to show it or not but we'll see and we found them Look at there, big old red chair. The queens in the red chairs. In the snow. In the snow. In the snow. In the snow. Stop for lunch up here on the side of the road. Right here by the river. Got us a nice little view for lunch. It's gonna be a simple lunch, just sandwiches and such. But uh, yeah, we're gonna sit right here and enjoy the sounds of the water. We're fixing to go hike the Malign Canyon. Everybody we read says upper cantaloupe is not a scenic. There's a lower cantaloupe than the one that fits your title falls. Ah. Oh, it's got the trails marked on here too. Oh, there's a column. Mm -hmm. Does that mean grade 7? No. No, it means trail, pat, seven. trail 7, path 7. It will, it's all downhill you until you got to go back. We are now on the first bridge. Nice and quiet on this side, isn't it? All right, so that was the uh, image from the first bridge. Now we'll go down and check out the second bridge.
So we gotta go up, turn the corner, and we gotta go down. All the way up. Yeah. Stay tuned. Boy, it's clear, isn't it? Alright, so we're going down these steps. And right at the bottom of these steps, I think, somewhere, there'll be another bridge. And this is the fourth bridge. Not much to see but the canyon. You can hear the water. Check the other side. Oh yeah. You can see it coming down. There's the E-R moment. Katrina decided not to come on down here with her knee bothering her. So there she is. Way up there. On the top of the canyon. We can almost see if I can make it back up for head base. Look at all them railroad tracks coming through here. So we're going to stop here for dinner tonight instead of fixing it at camp. And uh, we were told about this pizza joint here called Jasper Pizza, which is, uh, well, there it is, right there across the street. And so we're going to go in there and try us some elk pizza and have us some dinner. The Jasper Pizza place came highly recommended, so we thought we'd try it. Elk Pizza. If you like our content, hit the like button, subscribe, and then click that bell to get notifications of new videos.